Welcome to the Vuzik podcast, video number 16. We're going to take a quick look at how to use Vuzik VM. It's a great tool for organizing your presets, but a great tool for adding other MIDI options to Vuzik Station. So here I'm loading Vuzik VM to my favorite host. I'm using Orion. And inside Vuzik VM, I'm going to load the VST Vuzik Station. Then I'm going to select a preset. I'm going to use the DIG1 2 and 2 preset. Raise the volume a bit. So this is the 2 and 2 preset. Then in Vuzki VM, here at the top, I have my MIDI option. Here to the MIDI option, I can select to load, and I'm going to load the Vuzki Arpeggiator. It's a MIDI VST. You can also load the directory to your host if your host supports MIDI VSTs. So I have here my Arpeggiator. I can leave it on top of other windows. Let me play something now. So I have here my speed and the mode, and I can also select how I want the notes to be played. I can right click and select some patterns. So it's a pretty basic arpeggiator, but with some nice options. There are other options for the MIDI tools. I can use other options. Let me check here. There's the key switching option and the melody option. The key switching is great for use multiple instances of music station on separate channels in your host. And I use the key switch to select which instance I want to play. And the melody tool is another great tool because I can play on my bottom area of the keyboard, a chart. And this chart is going to be used for the white keys starting at key 60. So what I'm doing, let me play a C sharp chart here. And I'm just going to play the white notes one after the other and it's going to use the notes I'm playing at the bottom of the keyboard, just like it shows here. So I can uh, use different combination of charts. I'm just playing this on my keyboard and the Vosky VM melody is going to record those. And when I start play starting at note 60, just the white keys is going to follow. So it's pretty easy to work with charts. You can use several types, one finger chart and select with right click here the chart you want. You can also use octa tr transposer and you can select another split key here. Just learn the split. I'm going to learn at key 36. And there are other options you can do with VM. I'm not going to talk about the, the FX, 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 let me check here. I'm not going to talk about the FXP option, but uh, I'm going to, to talk about this on another tutorial. But this is already a great start, so you can load the, the arpeggiator here directly with Fusky VM and do some nice sounds with it. So that's it for this video. Thank you.